So if you're going to be trying to get the Volcano Finger at the very beginning of the game, it is possible. Uh, it might not be easy, but you can do it. Uh, the way that I went about this is I went from the first step all the way to the Stormhill Shack as normal. You can just ride past everything, picking up the graces and map pieces as you want. And ultimately, we're trying to go around the castle. So you're going to the right side of the castle here from that shack, and you're going to go around the entire castle until we make it over here to lakes, to Lernia Lakes. This is the cliff side race. You're going to get this. You're going to come over this side, and I took these down. There's other ways to get down, but this is the way I chose to go. Oh, a oh, little bit of frame loss there. Um, and I took this all the way uh, up to the academy. And now from the gate here, when you get here, we're going to come around this way. You can get the note at the very top, and it'll tell you exactly where the key is if you'd like. Or you can go this way, and you can find it coming around the outside here. You're going to come out here until you find the dragon, and behind the dragon is a key. It doesn't matter if you... You don't have to kill the dragon. As you can see, I left him alive. I'll go behind him just so you can see what I mean. You can go back here. There'll be a few bodies. You need to pick up the one that's on there, and then I just ran back out. But you can just die, too. Either one works. And I think I got the, um, the grace that's over here. Oh, I went the wrong way. You can just run away or, or die or whatever you need to do. And then you just work back to the gate. Now, all we do from here is we're going to go inside. So we're going to make our way out here as we normally would. We're just going to run through here. We don't need anything that's here. Maybe you get hit a little bit. Maybe you take some damage. Not really a big deal. So what we're doing is we're coming up through here. And we're going to jump onto this lift. But instead of going up, we're going to end up going down. Later, dog. You're just going to stay on this thing until it hits the top. And you're just going to kind of walk over and start taking this all the way down. Great. So now when we get down here, this thing will just throw us off. And what we're going to do is we're going to look for this thing to do that attack. We want to make sure we die to the grab like this. Perfect. Now that we're going to die to this grab, it's going to take us all the way to the Volcano Manor. But it's not going to take us directly there. There's a couple more steps, unfortunately. So this is the easy part. We've done a lot of easy stuff until now. And it's going to be a little easy when we get there, but you'll see what I mean. So it drops you off here. Now, the way I went is I just ran through this. I didn't wait for anything. I didn't go looking much. I just ran through. I didn't fight any of these guys. I kind of hit some lava or something. That's fine. But you're just trying to run on through here. You can do this tech if you if you know how to do it, of course. And you're going to stay on the right side, and then you're going to drop down where you see on these ledges. Heal up real quick just to make sure I don't die anything to die to anything stupid, you know? Made enough mistakes already. Don't need to make more. And if you die during any of this, it's not really that big of a deal because, I mean, you're not really trying to gain or lose anything here anyways. There's going to be a couple of guys here and you can just run past them. There's a grace right here that you can get. The quickest way to this boss room is you run down this. It's going to be here. Jump to this one. Jump to this one. And you just keep on running. And this will be a floor that collapses into this hole. So you stand on this and you'll fall down here. And there'll be a boss room down this way. And you're going to have to fight two of the two of the murder bots that are down here. This is the hardest part. This is the hardest part by far. I did it with a... I did this at level 23 with a plus four Uchi Katana and a 100% heater shield. Or 100 versus physical heater shield. Along with the skeleton militia ashes. So after you beat this boss, it's a lot of running. You're going to jump down this. You can grab all the graces as you want. I've already grabbed the ones that are along the way. Now I do suggest grabbing every grace along the way. This one is an important one. And you'll see why in a second here. That's why. And we're just going to run past the magma worm that appears there. We're going to ignore all of this. You can grab these if you still need more runes. There's also going to be one of those big bear things up here. So you got to look out for that. So I go up the right side of this. And the reason I go this way, because right here will, the, will be the prattling pate for it. You're beautiful. And that's important to me. So I grabbed that. You can just run over to this grace, hop off, grab it real quick to reset this boss here but the other reason i was just grabbing that one 
is because we're coming up to another part that um, I haven't had trouble with, but I could see being an issue. Now, as you're running up to this, a Scion is going to drop from the sky. And we're just going to jump off and immediately get on this ladder as fast as we can. He's doing his little buffs. He's freaking out. He's trying to get to us. He won't be able to. And we're going to basically be going up a couple of huge ladders. And those guys won't even see you, so you don't have to worry about them. You could stop at that merchant if you want and grab some stuff, but I don't know if that's really worth it necessarily. But it's definitely an option. And this is the way I went. I don't... You could go around if you really wanted to. Woo! This will take you to this grace. This grace is kind of important. Uh, you probably want to grab this one just in case you die between here and our last little bit we're almost there and what you're gonna do is you're gonna be aiming to go off the right side here as fast as you can don't even look at this thing we don't even need to look at it who cares about it right who needs it and this door at the bottom here behind this giant will be open so we can just run straight past him and all these guys you can run straight on through you can jump on in oh just be careful might get hit by something like that. And then you'll open up these doors and uh, you're in. Welcome to the Volcano Manor. She'll give you the key and then we just go straight over. We'll go in here and the finger will be right here on the table and you can just start invading immediately. But yeah, that's how you get the finger, you know, before you even get your first rune. So there you go. Good luck and have fun invading, I guess.